if you're anything like me, which I know you guys are, you've got all these photos, right? And you're always thinking, what on earth am I supposed to do with them? Do I keep them organized in my computer? Do I put little bowls of them out? How many more photos can I frame? So one thought I'm having that hopefully is something that you'd like to do too is create cool little photo albums. Now these are of course wonderful, beautiful gifts. They are thoughtful and sentimental and it's something that surely I would love to receive so I'm assuming you would love to give them and receive them too. This is a cool gift for Mother's Day or a birthday. You could do cool themes. You know, just go with your creativity and just have fun with this kind of thing. These are really easy to do. You can buy these darling little photo albums for like, you know, pocket change at any craft store, wherever you are. They come in a gazillion colors, which is wonderful. And then all you have to do is go into your stash or buy a bunch of really cool little ribbons and little goodies. You don't have to spend gobs of money, just some cool things that inspire. Or open your drawers, my loves, and find all that good stuff that you have already and start gluing it on. This is a total hot glue gun, fun, creative little excursion that you can have. So for me, I framed a beautiful picture of all the girls in our family, and I'm just going to start layering on ribbons and creating a beautiful, sentimental photo album that, you know, I may just give to somebody special. To the ears of melancholy, to dwelling in your misty gray hours with the longing in my belly. So, you know, once I kind of get my ribbons on this photo album and I sort of trim a little bit, you know, then I start to think about what kind of other goodies I want to add on to it. Now, of course, you guys know me and my trusty glue gun are the way that I like to do things. It's fast for me. You know I'm not about perfection. I'm just about having fun and putting something together. But if you want to use spray mount or something like that, you know, you certainly can. There are a gazillion different kinds of glues out there, too. So, you know, you can experiment with the things that you feel most comfortable with. For me, this is so no-brainer, and I love it, and I can plug it in, and I can just go and make this stuff. And, you know, look how darling this looks already. It's so cute. I could leave it here. But, you know, I can't help myself. I've just got to keep pushing the process. So I found some little goodies that I want to add on. I've got these lovely little... Um, velvety leaves that I think are so pretty and you know you can just play around with how you want to position things. Oftentimes what I'll do is I'll just kind of set everything out and just kind of decide oh do I like it like this or you know I'll kind of take things and I'll sort of pre-position them. Maybe one of these darling little um, buttons would be really cute right on the leaf and then maybe one of these pretty little um, goodies would be pretty over here and oh maybe I'll layer one of these on top. So then I just kind of eye it up, decide if that's how I like it, and then I, you know, move it all off and start gluing it up again. So, you know, you can see how very snappy that project was. And isn't this a darling little number? You know, you could do, you could buy a few different colors of these, which I think would be so cute. Fill them with different themes. You know, one could be a nature theme, because I know you guys take a lot of cool nature pictures. One could be kids or grandkids. You know, you could do different colors, you know, a pink one for a certain thing. You know, just, you know, this is one of those projects that I think you can really play around. You could literally cover the whole front of the album and the back, you know, do a little ribbon around this or whatever it is that you want to find. But the great thing about this is if you want to give it as a gift, it's very thoughtful. It's, you know, sentimental gifts are the coolest things. Anything you can do from the heart. You know people love that kind of stuff. And if you're not giving it to somebody else, of course, do it for yourself. You know I'm all over that. Anything you can do for yourself, you could put these all over your house. They will be gorgeous, I have no doubt. I cannot wait to see the photos of the ones that you guys make. Mm -hmm.